a lot of this was meant to be, they said you know, they were dropping hints throughout the first season about things that, um, you know, it happened. So they could always do it, come back and do a prequel. And they did, they, they actually, they, they wanted to do flashbacks. That was going to how to handle, when they're doing the escapes and stuff, they're going to go back. You know, when Spartacus was leading the big slave rebellion, they were going to go back. They've used that all now. But they're going to have to, they're going to have to go back and fill in the gaps with the same people that are no longer working for the show, who have other things to do with them. You know, like Hannah's working on, hopefully, the next, you know, uh, okay. The, the guy that runs the, uh, the gladiator school happens to be the brother-in-law on the, uh, the Mummy movies. Oh, really? Yeah, and Sean Hanna. Oh, that's right. Okay. Yeah. okay. Lucy, that's right. I forget. I don't think you uh, mentioned Lucy that. Lucy Lawless basically happened to be the boss's wife. Not, not McKnight, but one of the other bosses. And she's gone, so... And, you know, and you've got to get, you got to find a time when you can get all of these people they were in the slate in the gladiator school back so that they could fill in these these bits and episodes because they're not going to do I know the intention was they weren't going to do like thirteen weeks, you know, straight with people basically fighting that with Roman Reigns. You're talking that's too got off of Betsy. Mm -hmm. But you go back to gladiator school. Mm -hmm. So uh, I, I really <laughs> they shot his best material was already gone. I know. It's already been used. And, and well, you know, this when you love a challenge. I don't think they like challenges like that. Not quite a lot of those, like. Uh, because, like I said, I do remember. I mean, I, I, I. It'll be interesting to see how it pulls it all together. Yeah, it, it's why television series is, don't like it when the main actors um, don't show up for the next season. Because then it causes. Because it's not like they stop filming, they continue to do it, they just replace them. Mm -hmm. But how do you replace everybody in a show? Which is what they're doing for Section 3. Isn't that what X-Men did? Yeah, it died too. So, <laughs> you can't do that. You can't change. I mean, they, the, the whole trick is, I'm, I'm, I'm willing to bet that, um, that they know, they knew that the gentleman wasn't coming back and they were just, you know, the making, you know, trying to, because what you don't want to do is, it was a nice guy that said it was his first chance of really being a star, he's got a nice family. You don't want to destroy his recovery by saying that they're doing this prequel so that people will forget you existed. Right. So, because they're not showing blood in the sand except on DVD. Oh, really? You'd, you'd expect that to be all over stars, or all over Encore, oh, it's not it's there. Not. So they're burying that character. The prequel buried the character. So, but I mean, we've we rambled on and on and on about this. But, but see, now you have to go see Spartacus. Yeah, because we're giving you a little hint about the, you know, the section. We don't tell them all this stuff, but there are some really Oh, no, there's pages and pages but, of yeah. notes here. Now, lots of stuff. You know, actually, if I had to read my notes, I'd be in trouble. So, <laughs> no, I just use them because I got everything stuck there. But my guess is you can catch it what, on Stars for reruns. Yeah, Stars is getting ready to on start. Encore, the, Netflix. Uh, it is. Uh, uh, they're probably going to run DVDs. Uh, they're gonna. It's on Netflix. It's on Duke Blue. They said go look the Blu-ray. But they'll run the series before the new one starts to keep yeah. get yeah. people's interest again. And uh, so, and then they'll do. Uh, I, I'm willing to bet that uh, they'll basically, what they did, here was a thing which they did actually do was good, where they'd have the characters here doing one thing and then, you know, so they froze in motion and in the background, you know, which would be a, a green screen, would fade to them in another thing. Mm. So, which is really good, that's a good green screen effect, that's what it's meant for because they could change the thing. So what will happen is, you'll probably have, I, I can make a guess, you'll have Hannah and, um, and Lucy Wallace and some of the others there tying in what happened before with what happened now. Mm -hmm. And there'll probably be a fade. And then you'll do like they'll, you know, like um, John Wayne in The Searchers when the door closes and he walks, you know, he, he's walking away and the door closes. What's going to happen is they're going to like walk away. And then you're going to see the, you're going to see a different set of action. That's that's my idea how it will be done. So mm -hmm. because I saw the trick being done, and it's the reckoning was the last episode. Oh, and you saw the last episode. We saw the last. Oh, one. we saw the last one. We saw the last one before the new one comes on. Mm -hmm. And I'm guessing since they kept playing that trick in the deal, they were tipping their hands about how they're going to handle moving mm -hmm. back into the Spartacus. So 
Yes, until next time. This is old camera. And this is not a spring chicken. We're here yesterday, today, and tomorrow. For more information, you can always go to www.montybubbles.net on the net. And wherever you're watching us, subscribe to us, follow our daily newscast on 3D. And thank you once again for over 40 million links on the internet. And we do have RSS feed now, so you can subscribe to it also, besides our websites, which are numerous, but I don't know, real sites. So. <laughs>